Hey guys, so I just want to do a quick little video here showing how you can take a screenshot on your Galaxy Note 3. So I'm going to show three different ways. There could be even more ways you can do this, but the most traditional way I think is when you hold in your home button and the power button here on the side at the same time. You just hold in there for a few seconds. It will take a screenshot, save, saving screenshot here. And now it's finished. Now you can share it, edit it, and delete it. Now there are two other ways also that I know that um, how you can take a screenshot. Uh, one is that you bring out your S Pen. And then what you can do here is that you can hold in this button on the side, hold in on the screen, and there you go. It's taking a screenshot and pretty funny here. It instantly opens it up here uh, where you can edit it. So you can see here I can I have the eraser tool here. I have the pen here, uh, which we can change the color and all, all kind of cool things with. Uh, we can also resize this picture. Another little thing you can do uh, also if you want to take a screenshot is if we go here, uh, if you go into settings and if you have this enabled, if you go to controls, you go down to palm motion and you have capture screen. Now with this thing, uh, if you have this one enabled, then capture screen by swiping it from the right to the left or vice versa with the side of your hand. So. How it works is very, very simplistic. You have your hand like this and then you swipe and it takes a screenshot. Very, very simple. So three different ways you can do it on uh, that I did show in this video. There are probably a ton of other ways maybe even that you can do it. There are a ton of features also I want to go over uh, with the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. But uh, take a screenshot, delete it, edit it and share it. You can see here, share it with all kinds of services. This is why we love Android because we have a lot of sharing and freedom. Uh, uh, you have a flash annotate, okay, a photo editor. So you have two editors here. I haven't checked this out too much, uh, but you do have a, a here. You can also go in and change the, uh, a ton of things like brightness, uh, contrast, saturation, and just a ton of more things like red, red and green and blue colors. Uh, the temperature, the exposure, it's just a ton of ton of things. The hue, if you want to have some fun here uh, with a bunch of different colors, you can do it as well. And then you can save it there at the top. You also have some other features here, portrait mode, no face detected. So you can see here clearly there is no face here. Have different kinds of frames that we can use. And what else do we find here in this wonderful phone? Because you did see I had another thing that I could also do, another editor. Which I haven't really tried. I think actually that must be a... It takes a few seconds to save the screenshot though. Okay, so edit. I tried the photo editor, but what is flash annotate? Okay, so this is the editor that you usually get when you bring out the S Pen and hold in the button and, and hold on the screen, take a screenshot. This program will go up. Of course, I don't have to use the S Pen. I can just use my hand or my finger here and I can shift between different pen size, the pen, pen variants here. Uh, so that's the pen settings. Uh, I have the razor tool here to go back and forth and just resize and have some fun here. And then it will copy that to the clipboard, which is another place, I think, in your gallery. So uh, just quickly look here at how we take a screenshot with the brand new Samsung Galaxy Note 3. Have a good day.